we're all into whiskey because it's what makes us tick. We're, we're you know, really enthusiastic about it. And, and this is a great example of, of why we do what we do. When I, we drove all the way to Loch Lee, we weren't expecting to pick out a three-year-old ex-red wine cask. You know, that wasn't what we were expecting. So yeah, great surprise. So yeah, three-year-old whiskey, only just three years old, um, distilled in February 2020, uh, matured full three years in a Cabernet Sauvignon hogshead, red wine hogshead. Beautiful, lovely strawberries and black currants. You know, it's like electric Ribena on the nose. It's properly bonkers and, you know, it's, it's clearly young, but I think that's one of its qualities. It's not immature. It's definitely youthful. It's, it's, you know, got nice kind of spirit character still, but it's got such good harmony with the the red wine cask and it's got fruits and it's got lovely zingy zestiness to it. I like the word vibrancy to describe this whiskey. This one just seemed to have a, a flash of personality that was impossible to ignore. Um, and I must admit I was a little bit kind of uh, cautious at first thinking oh god is this going to be something that is going to deliver and yeah we were really surprised when it did. To be at the, the earliest stages of a new distillery is uh, very rewarding, very exciting, it's kind of validifies us. You, you've never tried everything, you know, even, you know, I've been in the industry now 10 years and you still find new things that surprise you and you want to be challenged. It's exactly, I don't know, that's cemented for me now, this nose, this berry's nose and the thick of winter and dreaming of summer and all the beautiful fruits that come with it. So. Um, yeah, it's coming out just at the right time, so we'll hopefully get this in front of some beautiful sunny Scottish days, I think.